Hi guys! So in this video we will continue creating our first positive login test and also I will explain how to use weights in Selenium, how Selenium can wait for page to load or for element to show up and stuff like that. So first of all, uh, where did we finish? So we finish on push sign in button and actually here uh, we didn't make it correct here because this uh, push sign in button returns profile page then in our login test we also need to create our new profile page so let's before this let's do profile page profile page equals and that's what is gonna equal because when we push the init button when you actually when you hover over you can see that it will return profile page so our it's not it's no longer gonna be login page when you click on this button it's gonna return profile page so let's import our profile page import profile page com dot dice dot pages now uh, next we need to wait for profile page to load because it takes some time to load the page and we actually we want to verify that it's it's actually loaded before we can proceed with any new steps on on the profile page so let's open profile page and let's create new method let's call it wait for profile page to load it's gonna be public it doesn't return anything void wait let me copy it from here already have it have the name of this page in my plan so wait for profile page to load and in this method we're gonna wait uh, but but the actual wait we will create in our base page object because we're not gonna use wait only in this page we're gonna use it in many different pages so that's why I would like to prefer and create weight in our base page object. So let's go to the bottom of the page and let's create method protected. Wait. Uh, let's call it wait for visibility off. And in this method, we basically gonna wait for visibility of any given locator. So we need a locator. And timeout. Integer optional. Timeout in seconds. Three dots, not two, three dots. So in order to use this method, we, we will have to give it the locator name. And if we want, if you if we want to change our timeout, our wait, which is by default 40 seconds, uh, we can change it here. So uh, now let's actually write the method. Uh, first of all, integer attempts equals zero now while while attempts less let's say two we're gonna do next try catch and inside inside of try uh, actually let's create another method first which we're gonna use inside of this method and the next method is going to be private void and let's call it wait for this method gonna use expected condition expected 
expected condition web element condition and also integer timeout but here it's not going to be optional it's going to be mandatory okay so time in seconds time in seconds equals time in seconds not no if it's null then time in seconds is gonna be 30 next web driver wait web driver wait wait equals new web driver wait but instead of 40 it's gonna be our time and our condition wait until condition uh, unused well it's unused right now but it's gonna we're gonna use it here so here in our wait for visibility of let's use this method wait for our condition which will be expected condition web element uh, we don't need that here expected condition visibility am I, am, I, am I doing it correct visibility of element located What's wrong? The metal is a bit like undefined for the type expected. Con oh, condition, conditions, expected conditions. That's what we need to use, and we need to I import it from the Selenium dependency. Uh, okay, so here we need our element locator and. I'm out in seconds, well, not exactly like this. This is the way we're gonna use it. Time out in seconds. Length. If more than zero, then time out in seconds. Get zero. No. like that so let me save and so you can just copy from what i have here so after this wait which is gonna break and the exception let's uh let's put stale element exception stale element exception and well we don't need to do anything with it just catch it uh, so if it's not gonna wait then catch exception and attempts plus plus to make it two attempts uh, I think we're done here with these two methods let's go back to our profile page so let's let's use this wait for visibility Wait for visibility of element and locator. Uh, I mean locator and time. Uh, so what are we gonna wait for? Let's go to our profile page on our dice. Um, so what? Well, maybe this button, edit profile button. Let's wait for this button. So. What is the best way to describe this edit profile? Probably this is button with class 
button default. Oh, ID, edit profile, awesome. Button with ID. Uh, let's create our private by edit profile button equals by expat button with ID like that. Let's verify if our X path is correct. Console. Enter. Yep, only one button and it's correct. What else? Uh, well, I guess that's it. That's good enough for right now. So let's wait for visibility of our edit profile button. Uh, let's use default timeout, which is 40. Uh, well, let's let's add just in case. Uh, let's save it. Okay, no more errors. Uh, let's save it and le let just in case. Let's add another wait. All well, this advanced search we're gonna use it in the future. So let's let's create another advanced search button locator. Let's use well, let's use class for it. Let's verify first if, if it's gonna work. Okay, so what it was, A with class. So A at class equals this. Yep, that's correct, X path. So let's use it in our project private by. Advanced search button. Equals by X path. I guess I already have it. Paste. So we have advanced search button. So let's also wait for, for this one. Wait, control space. Let's select it from here this object object base page object where's oh here is wait for visibility of our locator uh, instead of default 40 let's make it 10 so it's gonna wait for 10 seconds after the edit profile button showed up it's gonna wait for advanced search button well it should be there but it's not it's gonna wait for additional 10 seconds so wait for profile page to load method created Let's use it in our login test. So here in login test, we're gonna use our profile page variable or instance profile page dot wait for profile page to load. Just like that. 